The flu is a distinct illness caused by one of the influenza viruses. It typically comes on very quickly. You go from feeling totally fine on a Monday morning at work to by the end of the day feeling like you need to go to the hospital. Besides being out for a week, you can feel terrible for a week after that and then complications are very common. Uh, the most common complication of the flu is bacterial pneumonia. 30 to 36,000 people die of the flu every year in this country. That can be healthy people, that can be old people, that can be young people, that can be people all in between. The purpose of a vaccination is to introduce to the body parts of the very virus that we are vaccinating against. Very seldom do we use a live virus. Uh, those parts of the virus are actually injected into the body. The body has a way of making cells that will then recognize when that virus tries to enter the body again. And they make these cells to fight that virus. Basically, we introduce immunity to the patient without them actually having to have that illness. When I ask uh, a patient if they get flu shots every year, and they say yes, I say great, That's I commend them for that. When they say no, I ask them, well, is, is it because you're concerned about getting a flu shot? They will either say no, it's just I've not had time, and at that point I say, well, make time to have a flu shot, and I, I express to them the importance of that. The flu shot cannot give you the flu. It's impossible. The flu shot does not include uh, live viruses. They don't include bits and pieces of the outer layers of the viruses. It's the only first-line defense that we have. Is the flu vaccine 100% effective? No. Uh, has it, was it less effective this year than normally? Yes. It was supposedly about 23% effective. But that's still 23 people out of 100 did not get the flu because of the vaccination. I don't want to be sick at all. So if I can take a shot that will help me prevent that, that's what I'm going to do.